my channel. My name is Ivy D. I'm here to talk all things beauty. And for those of you who are new to my channel, thank you for stopping by. My name is Ivy. I just heard a little ghost in the background. Um, <laughs> my name is Ivy. Um, I like to talk about wigs and stuff. If that's something that you are interested in doing, um, please make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell down below. It's free and uh, you'll get to sit here with me. Um, so today is Thursday, so we're doing a throwback Thursday video. Um, this unit is an oldie but a goodie. Y'all have seen this all over YouTube. Um, and it is by the Janet Collection and it is Gabriella. So you guys know the drill. I'm going to go ahead, cut, um, get this shorty situated on my head and then I will be back to talk to you guys, um, about this unit in a second. So stay tuned. I'll be right back. Just to tell you guys right from the jump, this unit was about $17 and I got it off of wig types. This I think is about a year, maybe a year and a half, almost two years old. Um, I remember seeing my first review for this unit like literally a year and a half ago. So it's not super, super old, but it's definitely got um, at least a year on this unit. Um, and this, size, like I said, it was really popular. I just wanted to try it and see what the hype was about. Like I said, this is from the Janet Collection. This is Gabriella. I have it in the color 1B. Um, the front of the unit just talks about the fact that it's got a deep lace part. So um, there's no lace to cut off of the front, but it does come with this lace part. And this is it. This is all the parting space that you're going to get. So if you want a side part, you have to shift it. Um, I wouldn't really recommend that because the part is so deep, but you can do that if you like. On the back, it shows you some of the other color options um, or it lists some of the other color options and then it shows you some, tells you how to take care of the So wig. to talk about the construction of the unit, it's got two combs here in the front, one comb in the back and then the adjustable straps. I would say that this is big head friendly. It's more of a snug fit, but it's a very comfortable snug. It's not too tight. It's not uncomfortable. The fit is perfect. Um, in terms of what I did to the unit, all that I really did was pluck this part and then I went in and um, cut the little line of demarcation. I don't know where that thing is. I like literally threw it somewhere just now, but um, because it's a lace part, usually lace part units do have that little like folded over line of lace in the front and it looks very unnatural. So most people cut that out. So that's all that I did. I cut the line of demarcation out and then I put some powder on the part and that was it, laid her down. As soon as I touched her, she went from this to the, like she got huge like she this is this the more you touch her the bigger she will get so you really want to like keep your hands honestly i would advise that you keep your hands out of this unit because the more you touch her the bigger it's going to get and it's just going to balloon and balloon and balloon the only way to really control that would be either to apply like i was thinking about maybe doing a wet look with it but i don't really think this is a wet look kind of wig i would probably end up like cutting some of the layers out of it if I felt like it just got too too big um because this is some big hair but anyway that was all I did it's very low maintenance and it's very beginner friendly because of the fact that it's a lace part so you really don't have to do much to it at all um the volume I kind of just talked about this but it's huge um like I said don't touch it too much the more you touch it the bigger it gets but if you want a voluminous curly look this is honey this is for you like it's it's really pretty. The volume is really fun. I like the volume. I like that there's a lot. I like that it's big. Um, for me, it's just there's like a time and a place. Like I might not wear this to work. Um, to me, this is more of like I'm going out. I'm going to have fun. It's not bad. I would wear it to work. It's just a lot. It's distracting. This is a little too fun for me for work. 
um but it is really pretty so i mean I, I don't know maybe i just lied i'll probably end up wearing it to work tomorrow who knows um but like i said volume it's there um i'm not getting any shedding but i'm not again i'm not really touching it so please Keep that in mind. If you're getting shedding, you're touching it too much. You shouldn't be getting a lot of shedding from this. It's curly, so any hair that is loose will pretty much stay wrapped up in the unit, to be honest. So if you're getting a ton of shedding, you're touching it too much. You're pulling it out. Just leave it alone. I haven't gotten tons and tons of shedding or anything like that. So that's really not anything you have to worry about. Um, for the length, this appears to be, I don't know, maybe 24, 26 inches. Um, and I'll show you guys. This is the front, obviously. This is the side show you guys the back and then of course the other side so like i said i would say this is probably like 20 24 26 inches or so it's pretty long but um because it's so much volume it doesn't look as long as it actually is so that's something um the only other thing that i would say about the look of this unit is it is pretty shiny you guys can see it's got a good amount of shine to it um this isn't quite luster luster and shine are two different things you want luster you don't want shine necessarily when you're wearing a synthetic wig so i would probably dust just a little bit of dry shampoo over this just to tone it down a little bit so that I could you know walk outside in the sun and not feel like i'm glowing so that's one thing to keep in mind it is a little bit shiny other than that i do think it's really pretty pros it is a beautiful unit it's got tons of volume it's really really fun i love it in this classic like 1b color i think it is a really pretty unit um it's different um but still cute and classic at the same time the only con that i really have for this unit um i would say there are two one like i said if you touch it too much you're done you gotta you gotta take it off and and try again because it will just in my opinion like it will just get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger so that's one little con it's not really like a huge thing it's hard to say it's a con but like it's just something to be mindful of the more you touch it the bigger it gets um the only other like serious con i would say would be the shine it's not like a serious con but like it's there it's shiny so that's really the only bad thing that i would have to say about this unit um so yeah let me know what you guys think if you have any ideas for any other older units that you guys would like me to do reviews on please let me know of course leave the names down in the comment section down below and I will run out and go grab those to do a review for you guys. Um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. And don't forget to follow my new Instagram, Ivy underscore D underscore beauty with three Y's. Um, that's where I keep everything up to date. And that's where I give you guys all the information um, for what is coming next. So make sure you follow that page. I am going to go ahead and wrap this up. Thank you guys for watching. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.